There was nothing else at all in the whole world but football. So here's my prediction for Austria versus North Macedonia, Euro 2020. I think Macedonia are going to win. Ilif Elmas, uh, Alioski, Goran Pandev. I fancy them, I think. Austria have picked almost the exact team that played against their friendly against England um, with just one change and they looked uh, so flat. I know it was a friendly, but... I want, I want a surprise, and I think this could be it. 2-1, North Macedonia. Uh, well, unfortunately, I were, was way off base with my prediction for Austria versus North Macedonia. It finished 3-1 to Austria. Um, it's, it's hard to really begrudge them that result, I think. North Macedonia didn't really have that killer instinct in front of goal. They didn't really create many chances, to be fair. They were playing on the counter-attack. Austria had most of the ball. Although it wasn't really till the 78th minute when they when Austria went 2-1 up where you actually thought Austria were going to get that second goal. They just didn't look like they had the quality. And uh, it was a lovely cross from David Alaba. Um, and uh, Gregorich... 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 Gregovic, uh, with a with a nice finish, getting in front of the the keeper and the defender, and then from that point onwards, I think the North Macedonian central defenders went on holiday. And Altovic's goal was, was pretty embarrassing. I thought the way he just ran ran round the back of one of the central defenders who just stopped. He, he didn't even track and run. He didn't. It was it was bizarre. Um, I mean, if they even if they knew they were beaten and tied in the running around in the heat, I, guess, I don't know. It was a bit embarrassing. I, I thought they they did look weak at the back from quite early on. Uh, the the centre backs were caught out a couple of times out of position. And it was a lovely uh, first goal. I thought um, beautiful cross, and then uh, Ler Lerner. Um, with a lovely finish, the back post followed in first time past the keeper. Alioski unfortunately not tracking his runner, uh, ca causing his usual mischief throughout the game. Um, got a, a usual um, well-deserved yellow card. But you could see how North Macedonia, they played very much in that game how they've been playing against better opposition, much like how they played against Germany. They were, they uh, look to counter-attack and they try and use Alioski's speed on the overlap on the left-hand side. And There were a couple of times where it almost came off. There was one in the first half and Alioski managed to get the cross in but it was cleared. And then they changed system a little bit so Elmas could get more on the ball. But it just wasn't really, really happening for them. There's definitely a lack of, lack of quality there. It was nice to see Goran Pandev score, um, older than me. Uh, but yeah, 3-1, not 2-1. But, uh, you know, it's congratulations to Austria. That's our first win in, uh, in the European tournament. So, bye. Thank you so much for listening to The Triple F. If you could please drop a like on our Facebook page, subscribe to the YouTube channel and follow us on Twitter, that would be massively appreciated. Hope you're all keeping safe and thanks again for listening to The Triple F.